What's up, everyone? It's Carlos with Toy Gigante. Please excuse the mess. This is a clean laundry, by the way. Yes, this is my new BMX bike I got not too long ago. It's cool. I love riding bikes and hanging out, getting uh, fresh air in my face and all that stuff. And the other day I went to Target and I found this. Only at Target. Tech Deck BMX. We're going to open it up and check out the scale of it. It looks like, uh, looks like we just got to check it out because I can't tell. So let's open it up and have a look. I got my favorite shirt on right now. I've been wearing it for 10 days straight. Hey, let's check this out. Let's open it up because... I was look I don't have uh, I have a couple of these but I haven't bought one in a long time. You will get a bike lock rail thing. You will get the bike itself. This is a Colt Look at that. That is that is cool. Let's check this out. Let's let's give it the full review here. That is cool. The fact that the wheels spin, the handlebars spin, and this is amazing. Look. Look at that like on a real bike. So if I shrank down to this scale, I can technically ride this bike even the pedals move. You can be like uh, like that mouse that drives the car in that kid's book or movie. You can be just like him. Okay, I have Gung Ho from the um, 25th anniversary style, around 118 scale. And we have classified series Gung Ho. Huge difference, I, you know. So, for him, let's see how he fits on here. So he's supposed to be, let's say, six feet tall. For what it is, it of course works for the smaller gung-ho. It works for, for a prop. If you want like a background prop, of course it works. But let's say you are going to Walmart and you find a bicycle and you're six feet tall. Is this what it would look like? Probably not either. <laughs> no, this is he's way too big. This would be a, like a 16 inch bike in real life. So that's what that looks like. If you're looking for a, a prop for the background, this is way too tiny, I'm sorry, for the uh, classified. But for the larger 25th anniversary, it works pretty well for a prop. So um, yeah, that is my um, review. I just wanted to check this out. You can do tricks, you can do like a bunny hop. You can do this trick, which I, I always want to do in real life, but I can't. This one. You need some pegs though. You can grind, but there's no, no pegs, so I don't know how that's... They should have put pegs on these. I know that this is like a new style bike and all that, but pegs, you should... I know there's some that I bought in back in the day that come with pegs, but... If you really, if you're gonna grind and all that, you need some pegs. I like bikes nowadays, but what we had back in the day, it was just much cooler, I believe. Because bikes nowadays, they're all about the simple geometry, which will uh, probably make you jump higher and all that. But back in the day, we used to ride on tanks. We had the. Uh, GT performers we had the 
Haro Master, Haro Sport, all those giant bikes that weighed a ton. And uh, that, that was great fun. I actually have a Haro Sport that I restored. It's, an, it's about a 93 Haro Sport. I'll show it to you guys for you BMX fans. It's hanging, it's hanging here in the uh, man cave, but I, I will show you real quick. And then I, I got to go because I got other things I got to do, of course. But I'm trying to make it so that I can focus more on my channel. If you guys enjoy it, let me know. Just having a good time today. It's it's just a chill day. So let's go check out the uh, the Haro Sport. Okay, it's uh, I'm not I can't bring it down right now because it's behind a bunch of stuff. But this is my fully restored Haro Sport with the pegs, gyro. It's got everything. It's got the um, Odyssey sprocket. It's got the red line cranks. And the truth is I've never even written this thing. It's too nice. I want to write it, but I still haven't. That's brand the tires are brand new. Look at this. These are brand new tires. They're uh Pana Racer tires. And uh yeah, I want I want to write it, but like I said, it's just beautiful it's a piece of art for me so it's it's my dream bike this is my dream bike i always wanted a haro sport bash guard is brand new you can't see it very well but everything is there like this it's a heavy bike it's a heavy crazy bike compared to my um my new um stranger bike which is fairly light and uh no pegs no nothing just really basic trick bike that I, I wanted to have. Let me show you one more thing. Check out the handlebars. Here, let me do this. Whoa, look at that. Check out the handlebars. Check it out. That's my baby. I had it re chrome too, everything. One of my babies, yeah. Love this one. All right, everyone, thank you for, for watching. I, I hope you liked the episode. I got to get going. All right, I'll talk to you guys soon, more soon. Bye.